Hey guys, let's introduce context to the, our project. So if you remember, the user repository has this get. Okay, now it's quite simple query, but let's imagine this is a long running query. So it's it's taking some time, not always, but some time when the system is heavy. So what can we do here? So um, how we can, for example, cancel the query when it takes longer than the expected. So here, uh, we, we need to introduce context actually. So what do we he do here? We define context and for each method, we just define this and luckily we have this context version of each method here as well. We just pass the context and that's basically it. Of course, we have to come here and do, do this for the for the interface as well. So let's come here, context. Now we are implementing this. And of course we have to do it for the service as well. So we gotta get the context and pass it here. Lastly, we got to come here, which is the main. And before calling that, maybe here or even above, we need to define context and cancel. And we're going to define context to with the starting point. This can be with timeout. And let's say, yeah, two seconds after it starts running. And we're going to just defer, cancel, and just we need to come here and pass the context. And that's basically it. And if it takes longer than this amount of time, then it will gracefully cancel it and we can then handle the error accordingly as well. That's one of the scenarios you can use and context would be very helpful for you.